My name is Penny Bass. I am the uh, High School South Kitchen Cafeteria Manager. I do all the uh, grocery ordering produce, bread, uh, get the menus ready, and things like that. Penny Bass, one of the several food service members at Bryant High, gives us an inside look on what it's like on the other side of the food line. I make sure that I get everything out that they need and then when the like whoever is the meat cook or whoever is the baker or the vegetable cook uh, they get started on it and then if uh, everybody else is finished we'll help the others to complete the meal. The menus are generally planned by the food service director but then it's up to the managers to make sure that all the food is purchased for each menu of the day and to make sure that everything that you have on the menu is provided for the workers to prepare the meal. I am food service secretary and I do work it on payroll right now, timesheets. Um, we order the food, like the managers turn in their orders and we turn it over to the our sales rep from Benny Keith who orders it in. Even though it seems that lunch can go smoothly, not everything can go according to plan. Uh, I guess maybe when things, uh, because of not coming in at the warehouse, then we don't get them and then we have to do menu switches and things like that. The food service department is separate from the rest of the district and so we run with a really, you know, as few workers as we can, but when someone is sick, you know, trying to keep everything going, you know, try to find subs to fill in, that's probably the hardest part. The food service workers at Bryant were also one of the several departments that were also affected by the millage not passing, who are counting on a larger cafeteria to accommodate the roughly 2,600 students. I serve on the line quite a bit, and I, like, I kind of like that because I like to, you know, hear, you know, kids come through, hear what they're talking about and all that, so. I enjoy getting to see the kids, and I previously was working at Hurricane Creek, and I've seen several of them come from kindergarten all the way up to fifth grade and then go on to middle school, and that was always enjoyable. For the Bryant Perspective, I'm Amalia Eddings.